Hey guys, Santi for today. Got an interesting mail from a uh, upper deck. This is a replacement for a replacement. Now, uh, the story behind this is uh, I got shorted hits in my artifacts boxes. Some of you are probably aware 2020, 21 artifacts, like about half of the boxes didn't contain any of the guaranteed hits. And uh, I received one of those boxes and so I got replacements. Uh, one of the replacements was a uh, redemption for dual jersey five, I believe it was, which was Arthur Kaliev. And uh, anyway, I got that card in the mail, and it was destroyed. You're probably seeing pictures of it now. Uh, it was pretty beat up. Yeah, I said it was like a PSA five at the time. It's probably lower than that. I. I have I've never seen a card that looks like that uh, from upper deck before. I have no idea what happened, but anyway, I contacted them and the uh, replacement has finally arrived. So, the replacement for a replacement that was redemption. Kind of confusing, but let's get into it. It feels like one card. It says it's a uh, one card on the front. So, let's see what it is. Hopefully it's something nice. And not just like the exact same card. That would be somewhat disappointing. So there's a little note here. Let's that out first. Let's see what this note says. It's like someone, some stains from, I don't want to know what. Blah, 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 highest trading card. We apologize to recent. We apologize the cards you recently purchased. I didn't purchase them. Did not meet these standards. We're more than happy to replace any damaged cards from our replacement stock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Let's get into whatever the replacement. Oh, there's actually two cards in here. Okay. So card number one. 2021 Artifacts. Rookies. Arthur Kaliev. Hey, there it is. The card's back. Uh, it's not the same one, of course. Well, it is. It's not the exact same copy, but this is what I got, obviously. And, uh... Yeah, let's see if it's as bad as the other one. The little corner issue there, but it's kind of standard with artifacts. It's nothing major. Same with down there. But I am not seeing the, uh... Extreme surface issues as the last one did, which is nice. Somehow the corners on the last one were perfect. Like, I've never seen that on an artifacts card. But the surface was just destroyed. But this looks to be okay. So that's nice. And there's something else in here, too. Let's see what it is. Now, rookie materials, probably Calia, right? No, uh, oh my gosh. Oops. Uh, Nicholas Bodan and Philip Kurashev. Ironically, I got a, a Bodan, I think, jersey autograph. My uh, prior <laughs> replacement. So, was this worth the uh, effort? Yeah. I don't know, is it like, whatever, but at least I got a nice one of these, although it's still kind of, <laughs> it's not in the greatest shape as you can see down there, but oh well, I've seen a better replacements, a little bit disappointing, especially considering I had to wait, what, three months for the replacement for this, and then... I had to wait like another two months for the actual card to come in. And then that got, that was destroyed. And then I have to wait like another two or three months for the uh, replacement for the replacement to come in. And uh, unfortunately, this is my reward. Oh, well, can't win them all, but I, they gave me a free card. So whatever. I've, I've seen much better replacements than that. So I went back and checked at how long ago this all started. Um, got my artifacts boxes about 10 months ago. 
uh, complained to them, complained to Upper Deck the day of, and they were actually very quick to respond to that. Uh, I, I can't, I can't uh, complain about that. They had it all resolved in like a day, a day and a half, something like that. But the replacements took two months to get to me, and the replacements were not bad. I'm not going to complain about the actual cards that got in return. Uh, you know, they were standard artifacts cards. But, uh, you know, sending a redemption as a replacement, you know, it makes sense in that situation since I was also, I believe I was shorted a rookie redemption, if I'm not mistaken. But, again, that doesn't really make much sense to send a redemption as a replacement since a redemption is something you replace anyway, right? Anyway, it took a... Uh, Five and a half months to get the uh, redemption card, which was a Calio that came uh, destroyed. And it, it was in this one of these top loaders, completely sealed. You, can, you guys can go back and watch the video. Uh, it was in the top loader. I obviously didn't take it out and uh, damage it myself. Why would I do that to a PC card, right? It's an Arthur Calio. I'm a Kings fan. I would not. It makes no sense for me to do that. Anyway. Uh, it took two and a half months to get this, uh, the Kaliev in still not very good condition, although it's, uh, not complaint worthy, it's a lot better than the, uh, other one. And then, uh, Nicholas Bodan and Philip Parishev dual rookie materials, which is, it's about a two dollar card, you can go on eBay, probably see it for that much, I know it's that much on Comp C right now. But, uh, yeah, it's a little disappointing, I think. I'm not trying to say, you know, Upper Deck should send me, like, a $100 card in replacement for this, right? But, I don't... <laughs> it's a $2 card to make up for 10 months of troubles and about, you know, multiple problems spawning from one is a little disappointing, to say the least. Like, I've, I've seen Upper Deck give, like, Kaprizov Young Guns for damage base cards in a blaster box. Which is obviously not as much as, not, not as much as a problem as a, this had been. You know, I'm not, I'm not trying to say, you know, I should be given some huge card or I'm not trying to be jealous, nothing like that. You know, but I, I, I personally think that when a customer has to deal with a problem and then they deal with arguably something that shouldn't happen or a redemption which is a re basically something you replace as a replacement and then and you need to replace that replacement I don't know but uh, I think Upper Deck could have done a better job <laughs> at replacing uh, or at uh, saying sorry to me for my troubles and a two dollar card and the card I should have received in the first place but yeah, you know, ten months, a few problems, had to contact Upper Deck multiple times, and unfortunately this is their apology. So that is it. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.